Hello, this video will guide you how to level the Wang Hao Duplicator Line series. So, for the bigger printers such as uh, Duplicator Line 500 or 400, they require leveling before you start printing. And uh, for leveling, you need to prepare one of the paper, A4 paper. It's roughly about 0.4 millimeter thickness. So let's go to the screen and the clean level. And here's the guidance, how to level it. You can read it. And also you can check the video in installation by QR code scanning. So you can check the video or next. Leveling is in progress. Because we ship the printer out, we tighten all the four locking, locking bolts under the bay to ensure there's no losing during shipping. So it could be with some angle, the bay and the logo with some angle. So you need to do primary leveling before you start printing. So now we, let's go back here. We check the logo and the bay difference. So now we can, we can see it's uh, roughly okay, but we, we still can adjust here. So you can see the axis, you can moving up and down. So now it's too far, so we can lower it. You can choose each, each clink, 0.1 millimeter or one millimeter. If we could one, one millimeter, you check each clink, the Z axis will move up one millimeter. And if we lower it one millimeter, it could be too, it, it almost touch the bed. So we need to change the, uh, each step to 0.1 millimeter. So this would allow us to do more accurate leveling. So make sure it's uh, not too tight or too loose. You need to use the paper to fill the fraction Ah, it's too tight now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I cannot, almost cannot move, which means the filament cannot go through. So turn back a little bit. Okay, so now it's better. And uh, we just make sure only the center point. Now we need to check the other points all around the building plate. So we, need, uh, and this time, all the motors are disabled. So we can move it freely. So let's move it to the left side to check the, if it's okay or not. Yeah, maybe from the corner. Oh, I can see. It's, uh, you see, I cannot go, go through one paper, which means it's too tight. So we need to roughly level the, to lose the belt a little bit. So we can get through the paper. Okay, let's check the right side. If we can get the paper through. Yeah, it's, uh, it, we can go through, which means it's about 0.1 millimeter. But it's still too, a little bit tight. So we may look, uh, tight it a little bit. So this side is also primarily level. Let's go back to the back side of it. Yeah, uh, it's too tight. Yeah, because the... Uh, even we use a bio touch, the compensation cannot that much, uh, too much. So we have to do this primary leveling. And we tight it. Okay, after tight, it's okay. We don't have to make sure it's very much accurate. Uh, and at this point, you see, I cannot even pull the paper. So I need to lose, to lose it a bit more. All right, all right. So we actually, we have checked the center point, left point, right point, right back point, and the left back point. So primary five points. 
to ensure the building plate is roughly, roughly leveled. By this way, the logo and the building plate are averagely okay. Then we go next. So the printer will start auto leveling. Then we'll check all the points on the building plate and, and uh, they will split the building plate into different squares. One square, one square, one square, one square, one square, and then compensate in, in different squares. So it's checking, even though sometimes the building plate is not exactly 100% flat, but with the build touch compensation, maximum uh, it can compensate 0.3 millimeter. So, but, but actually the building plate maximum during our checking is less than 0.1 millimeter uh, uh, difference. So it can compensate all this area even if it's not flat. So it will take some time to check the points, each line, line points. Uh, the more points we are checking by, by the sensor, the more accurate we can get the print. Oh, I did. Uh, I forgot to mention. I did not put the mat, uh, the surface mat, because this is uh, we are doing the aging test uh, now. So we, we use one paper uh, to uh, to do the checking. After that, we will stick the surface mat. Okay. Thank you for your watching.